Hi, this is Mr. Panda and today I'm going to show you how to have more time. So librarians are pretty busy people. I mean, we have to make time to read our books, right? And to make time, I need to manage my tasks in an efficient manner. Today I'm going to teach you the Pomodoro Technique. So this is the Pomodoro Technique. It's called like that because of the Pomodoro timers that some kitchens use. Now a Pomodoro is 25 minutes of work time and after a Pomodoro you get 5 minute break. This is what is called a cycle and after 4 cycles that means one Pomodoro, 25 minutes, then 5 minutes break, then another Pomodoro, 25 minutes, then 5 minute breaks. you can take a long break. Now, this works this way. Whenever you have a task that is too big that you cannot finish in 25 minutes, but you can probably going to need 2 hours, the point is to divide the task in chunks that you can manage. This would be Pomodoros of 25 minutes. And every 25 minutes, you take a 5 minute break. Now, this 25 minutes is, is not exactly full work time. It's supposed to be 5 minutes of review of what you're doing, then 15 minutes of work, actual work, and then 5 minutes of review of what you just did. And it's important to understand that whenever you rest, even if it's just the 5 minutes or the long break, you need to do nothing related to work. This is how the Pomodoro technique actually works. You need to give your brain a break so that it works better. And that is how you master the Pomodoro technique. It takes a while to get the hang of it, but as soon as you get it, it's gonna help you a lot. And you can also use some trackers like the ones I use. For example, this site. We go to tomatotimer.com. It looks like this, and I can choose between a Pomodoro and begin my time, or a short break after the Pomodoro is done, and then go back to another Pomodoro, and then go back to another short break until the cycles are done, and then take a long break. And it will, if I enable the desktop alerts, will tell me when each one of these timers has, has finished and I can keep on on my track of doing my tasks. And um, there are hundreds of other apps that will let you do this. Uh, you choose your own. Um, there are many on uh, apps. By, uh, there are many in phones and uh, in the Android store, in the Google store or the Apple store. You'll find your own if you want to, or you can use your own timer to do it. And for more tips and tricks like this, like and subscribe. See you next time.